Sheraton is a buzz about the arrival of our first guest to Her Majesty's Halloween Gala. You better mind your manners because she's quick to point out that money can't buy you class. Rise to your feet and recognize the Countess Luanne de la Seps. <laughs> Darling. Oh, how lovely. This is lovely, the Countess Luanne de Lisette. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, girl! I don't know, I can't stop talking like this all of the oh, time. I know, and I can't, I, I'm trying to keep my fangs from falling onto my lap. <laughs> <laughs> so, Luanne, what is your favorite Halloween memory? You know, um, I've had a lot of good Halloween parties, but one I really remember is on The Housewives. Um, we were we were filming, and it was a uh, like a New Orleans kind of um, Mardi Gras kind of party, yeah. and everybody dressed accordingly. And there was like, and we had like crustaceans on the table, you know, there okay. were octopuses and crocodiles, and <laughs> you know, so it really felt like Halloween. Yes. Um, you know, and of course, there's always a housewives drama at Halloween parties. <laughs> you know, a couple crocodiles in somebody's face and octopuses. <laughs> Being thrown about, you know, just the usual Halloween stuff. Yeah, the usual <laughs> with the housewives. Now, mm -hmm. I heard that a fan gave you kind of a, an amusing but very morbid type of gift. Yes, I, um, I, I once got a gift from a fan, which was actually a very small coffin, which was a jewelry box. What? To put my old wedding rings in. <laughs> <laughs> did give me a good giggle. <laughs> <laughs> so speaking of, of speaking of, of coffins to put old wedding rings from ex-husbands, how is your love life doing? <laughs> speaking of oh. coffins. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, I'm dating, but there's nobody right now that I really want to introduce to my kids. Okay. So, um, but you know, I'm having fun and I'm busy and uh, you know, doing my cabaret shows, and you know, I have a new show coming out with Sonia, which we'll, I'm sure we'll touch upon. Yeah, super excited about that. So, um, looking forward to the you know, three times the charm next man in my life. So, there you go. It's not <laughs> over, absolutely. It's, no, darling, never over. <laughs> <laughs> Now, you went to a BravoCon. It was just a melee. It was so many people there. How did you yes, enjoy it? It was, there was like 50,000 people at the yeah. Javits Center. It was huge. Um, and you know, I gotta, I have to say, our fans are just incredible because they just love the housewives. They love Bravo. Yeah. I think, you know, like a lot of people have like CNN on, they've got Bravo on, you know, uh, right, it just runs right. all day all long. Day, exactly. And you know, and I love you guys for loving the show too. And you know, um, it's a gift, you know, I, we've been doing this show, Housewives of New York, for 13 seasons. Wow, 13, 13 so. seasons. A long, long time. And so it's, it's nice to be recognized for that. And, you know, we share our lives with you guys. And um, so it's, it, it's great fun to be at such a big event with, with all the Bravo uh, yes, celebrities. Yes, because everyone was Bravo out celebrities, there. they call them. The Bravo so. celebrities, the Bravo I love celebrities. that. celebrities, yeah. Um, you know, they revealed the new cast of uh, Real Housewives in New York at BravoCon. Yes. How'd you feel? Well, I felt like Andy's been cheating on us. Oh. <laughs> um, you know, so, no, I expected them to announce them. I didn't know that they were gonna bring them out on stage at the show, so that was kind of, you know, I was a little surprised about that. Um, listen, you know, our show's been around for a long time. You know, they're a new diverse cast in New York, yeah. and so let's see what sticks, you know? I, I wish them well, and you know, I think we're gonna be doing um, the OG cast, so they're calling it the Housewives, um, oh my God, I forgot what they're calling it, Legacy. Uh, uh, the Legacy. They're calling it the Legacy, um, and so, uh, I, you know, I, I don't you know, know when that's gonna happen exactly, but I think that that's definitely gonna happen, and I think the fans really wanna see kind of the OGs coming back to the Absolutely. television. Absolutely. Sorry, I'm kind of like 
with, with your fangs. fangs on, it's very hard to... <laughs> no, I can understand you. It's so funny because, like you say, 13 seasons doing Real Housewives. And do you still, do you miss the cameras? It's been a long time. You know, I, I would say yes, I miss the cameras, but I just did a show with Sonia, so I'm, you know, I've been uh, working. I did uh, The Ultimate Girls Trip, which was a lot of fun yes. uh, for Bravo. And so, you know, I've been keeping busy, especially with my cabaret, so um, I just feel like, you know, when it happens, it happens. And, um, and, and I have not been, shy not having a camera around. Actually, I've been enjoying just having some downtime too.